LNG is virtually the same as the natural gas you use in your home, with two important differences. LNG is a liquid, and it's cold. Very cold. 260 degrees Fahrenheit below zero, to be exact. The advantage of being in a liquid state is that it takes up less space. In fact, 620 cubic feet of regular natural gas when cooled to a liquid results in no more than one cubic foot of LNG. Cold LNG vapor is also heavier than air, but as it warms it becomes lighter than air and rises. LNG is also environmentally friendly. In the event of a spill, it evaporates quickly. It leaves behind no residue and does not react chemically with the air. If spilled on water, it is not absorbed and does not harm sea life or affect water quality. And since 1964, LNG has maintained the best safety record of any fossil fuel. Unless trapped within a confined space, the burning will not create an overpressure or explosion, and LNG terminals do not create confined space. Another safety feature is that LNG by itself does not burn. The vapors will burn only when mixed with air, and then only with a lazy flame. A lazy flame means that LNG burns more like a candle than a blaze. This is different from other gas fuels, such as propane and gasoline, which are highly flammable. As LNG mixes with more air, the mixture becomes too lean to burn. This is called a lower flammable limit. Now it's important to understand that natural gas does burn. That's why it's an efficient and versatile fuel. However, for LNG to burn, it must be in a gaseous state in combination with air or oxygen. Within its storage tanks, LNG is always maintained in a liquid form, with natural gas vapor but no air above the liquid. The tanks are also well insulated and vapor tight. This means not only can oxygen not seep in, but LNG cannot seep out.